Right? First and foremost, we want to give all praise to Yahweh. Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, Shad, Hashem, Rekhavah, Das. The bondage of the apostles and elders of the great millstone. Peace, say, touch to the brother, right. work in sincerity and the truth. Those who elect the brothers waiting every day patiently for Yahweh, Hashem, Yahweh, to return so we get out this place. Peace, say, taste to you, brothers. Uh, and it's true, brothers, you know, we were, you know, uh, we, it's a, it's a, it's a time and for everything, you know, but everything is a time and space, but in this truth, yeah, you know, it's, we have to be really like men of action, you know, in this work, man, not men of just slothful, because the scriptures tell you about a slothful man, man, you know, uh, a slugger, everything else, you know, and the things we got to do, man, we just can't say, because there's a lot of people that, that, that I hear the word, but they won't um, do the, work, the Lord's work. You know, they won't. They won't do it. They they will hear the name of the Lord. They won't say it. They still call on Jesus. You know, but when when you come into this this work, the, the work of the real work, hey, the work is real. The the the, the fire is right. gonna get put on your ass. You know, so you you know the guys that just come out for the Israelite party. And when, they, when the Israelite party don't don't suffice them, they um they just they just uh go off in the wind and start going off and doing the uh, worldly th the worldly things. So, you know you can you can fake the funk and and think that you got it, you got it made because nobody can see you. But how about Shemuel Shai sees you, man? So That's right. Let me yeah. get that Romans, bro. Now this is the Book of Romans, speak, chapter two, verse thirteen. For not the hearers of the law are just before the Most High Yahweh, but the doers of the law shall be justified. Mm -hmm. All right, so kind, hey, if you hear what we're supposed to be doing, hey, that's not good enough. It's the doers of the law, all right? And hey, like it says in the book of Judges, chapter 5 and verse 11, hey, we shall rehearse the righteous act, all right? So, hey, we're going to do this work. That's right. And we're going to keep the laws to the best of our abilities, all right? Doing all that we can, all right? We know we can't keep it 100%. And we're here in Babylon, all right? Modern, modern day Babylon, which is America. But, hey, we have to be doers of the word. Right, God, because we can't be guys, that, uh, we can't be men that's in this truth just to say, no, I'm in it. No, we have to uh, do the will of Yahweh by Shimei always shy because. You know, uh, uh, we owe him, okay. You know, so so we have to do this work. You know, uh -huh. you know, you know, forget sitting on your ass. You know, but you know, you have to put put get up, put effort, and do the work. That's you know, right. mm -hmm. this, is, this is a quote I like. It say, so "You need to get up, get out, get something." <laughs> that right. means you making moves. Okay. You know, you making moves in this uh, in in your life. Make the move, the right moves. You know, you, we 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 not as other. We're we're not just uh, men that just supposed to be just going on and for that day and just having a not even thinking about the Lord, not even having our mindset upon what we got to do for the day for the Lord. Because every day is a day we do more things for the Lord. That's right. You know, keep our heart, keep our mind uh, focused on the the the, the Lord, man. And right. not just sitting here and and and, and not just doing, and not doing nothing. You know, you, if you don't, if you're not gonna hear, and you think that what 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 the prophet's been saying is nothing, you just like the scripture say up there, so you deceive your own self. You know, <laughs> it's like you are the stalemate. You you know, the stagnant. You know, have you ever seen a pool with um? Well, have you ever seen a pool? With mosquitoes lying, it, it just yeah. stagnant. There's no current, no nothing, nothing flowing. Mm -hmm. You got to be like water, son. Right. You know yeah. what I mean? Like, like you got to be just like water. You know what I mean? You got to make moves in this, in this truth, man. Like, the, why you think the um, the scriptures say about that in John seven and thirty eight? Yeah, flowing. Mm -hmm. right. Rivers of living water, man. Yeah, rivers of living mm -hmm. water. You got to be that, right? You got yep. one two thirteen. Uh, no, that was if I got another mm -hmm. precept. Uh, this together. is the book mm -hmm. of Revelation, chapter 3, verse 15 and 16. I know thy works, that thou art neither cold nor hot. 
I would thou were cold or hot. So then, because thou art lukewarm and neither cold nor hot, I will spew thee out of my mouth. Let your yea be yea and your nay be nay. It ain't, in Hebrew, I don't, I don't think it's a word for maybe. You know? <laughs> you know, so either you're going to do it or you're not. So he said, if you don't do his will, he said he's going to spew thee out of thy mouth. So that means what? That means you, you're going to be... You're, you're not going to have a good time in this place, man. I mean, meaning, I'm not saying a good time, like, because the men of the Lord are going to be chastened. I'm talking about when the time comes and martial law comes and, you know, you know, maybe, uh, I'm not going to say that there's not going to be men of the Lord that's going to get chastised or, or get put to death, but you're not going to have a good time in this world, man. Things are going to always be probably problems to you till you come back to the Lord, you know, mm -hmm. and can't believe, you can't believe, because you got a lot of guys that believe that you could just say, I love Jesus, and, and, and stick stick to that, oh yeah, I was shy, and I don't have, you don't have to do no work, no works, mm -hmm. you know, go ahead, bro. Yes, uh, book of Luke, uh, chapter uh, 14, verses uh, 23, and the Lord said unto the servants, go out into the highways and byways and yeah. uh what's that compel compel them to keep to come to come in that my house may be fulfilled may be fulfilled so that mean that that mean them men were doers and the lord was telling hey do do what i'm telling you that my house may be filled you know so those men who 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 went forth and did that, Peace they were out. hearers and they were also doers of the word. They did what was commanded of them, man. Mm -hmm. Right? So it said to compel them to come in. So that means they went out there to compel them, to tell them to talk to them, man. Yeah. To come on in, you know? Because, hey, I'm pretty sure they were, we doing it. So you come on in and, and then you start doing it, you know? And get out of this world. This worldly, mm -hmm. this worldly right. ideas, the ideologies and this shit. Because a lot of Israelites make up a lot of shit to look good in front of the ladies. <laughs> and why them ladies, why them ladies is, them ladies are, are these women are, are fucking traps and snares, man. And don't fall into that trap just to look good. You know, you see these camps that's like that, that 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 want to have the freshest garment, want to have the nicest Tims or the nicest, they got the, they got the, uh, the Houdini hats on. With they their um, outfits and stuff when they go in the uh amongst the the congregation <laughs> look good smell good wrist lit they have rappers have supermen have Israelites you know that's like being a uh, Muslim back in the day got the tightest suit the tightest hairline you know but it's always idiots in this thing man that just that could that could make a doctrine out of of, of fabrics you know what I mean or raps. Or whatever. They're deceiving themselves. Don't deceive yourself. Just follow the spirit. Who got it? I got a piece of it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, Book of Luke chapter 12 verses uh, 31. But rather seek ye the kingdom of Yahweh. And all those things shall be added unto you. Wow. Including yeah. your works. And that's mm -hmm. why I was reading that. So you know the man of Yahweh Mashimi Ashai that's doing this work. <laughs> We know the kingdom's at hand, so we're not going to be sitting on our ass no damn way. You know, we're going to continue to do the work. Right. The faith, because you, you're going to... Read that again, bro. Okay. Uh, Luke 12, verses 31. But rather seek ye the kingdom of Yahweh, and all those things shall be added unto you. Right. So... Seek the king will you have about you know what I'm Be a hearer. I mean, that means you're a doer of uh -huh. this thing. That means you, you're you making, you basically said, hey, I'm, I am I hear it and I'm going to execute. I'm a man of action in this thing. You, know? you got to be active in this thing. You, you know, we, we let the world do what they're going to do. We let Israel, we let Israelites going to do what they're going to do if they're going to make mm -hmm. up doctrine. We let them do because we already, the scripture said, compel them. We already on the highways and byways, you know. I'm not going to come tap you in the head like a Jehovah Witness and say, I ain't got nothing, nothing to do with that, brother. Right. They come out and, and with a book and say, listen, 
I'm going to tell you what uh, John Smith said. No, we're going to tell you what Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah said, man. And the, 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 the Lord has so chosen men to do this thing. And he, he selectively chose men that's going, he knew that was going to push this work. And then when he said, hey, he, he hey, but when he said he, he cast out the net and he bought all sort of fish, all, all type of fish, you know, unclean and clean. So you're going to find them in those, those camps. And then, you know, but we always, eventually those, those unclean get cast back in, into the, into the, um, the ocean, to, you know, where they, into the slop where they belong, man. You know, so you can't fool you how about Shimon Shot because if you come in here to think it's it all ends right here because I they look good and I could be on TV. I mean, I could be on the YouTube and people will see me and I could connect. And it's only about a worldly. Don't don't let this worldly heart, your the worldly actions make you uh uh stop doing the work of your how about Shimon your how shot for your for your own little greedy game. You know, because you look, you look stupid in the end. Okay, you got it. kind, uh, and you know it's a it's an incentive mm -hmm. for us that do this work. All right, this is the book of Hebrews, chapter six and verse ten. For the Most High Yahweh is not unrighteous to forget your work mm -hmm. and labor of love, which ye have showed toward His name, and that ye have ministered to the saints and do minister. Mm -hmm. So kind, yeah. Hey, it's an incentive. Hey, you're going to get a reward. Mm -hmm. Hey, the Heavenly Father ain't going to forget you, man. Hey, through the struggles, through fighting, through the week. Oh, man, I got to do uh, videos. You fight it hard. You feel like the Spirit ain't dealing with you. I'm talking about, and I'm mm -hmm. just speaking on me. Personally, I'm like, oh, man, I, am I going to be, hey, fight through it. The Lord is going to remember our labor of love. Uh -huh. Even if don't one person watch a video of pistol. All right, All right, the Lord know we did. Long time. That's a, that's a good one. That's a good one, bro. Uh, I get that real quick. Um, let's get that. Uh, what you, what you just said? They said it don't really matter because nobody is hearing. No matter what, nobody hear you. Kind uh, and and a precept I'd like to get to that is uh, Ezekiel uh, chapter uh, thirty-seven and nine, prophesy unto the wind. Kind and uh, this is um Ezekiel two and. I'm gonna go to four. four. Oh, yeah. For if they are impudent children, they are stiff hearted. I do not send thee unto them, and thou shalt say unto them, Thou sayest the Lord, Yahweh Shai, and they, whether they will hear or whether they will forbear, but they are a rebellious house, yet shall know that there has been a prophet among them. So they were gonna know eventually, man. Mm -hmm. You know, because when that martial law, they start kicking in your doors. If the spirit gonna bring in, in the minds of you guys that just laughed and mocked and, and 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 shrugged your shoulders or just said, "Hey man, I'm gonna I'm gonna teach the way I want to teach, not the way your your way." See, y'all going out to y'all going, you're not having the faith in the spirit. A lot of you guys just go into the um the way of your own ways and shit like that. So that's where your that's where your faith uh, you think is faith, you know, but it's really it's really it's mixed up. Because you can have faith in, people have faith in wrong shit. See, faith is, <laughs> you you got guys that believe, have faith in in in, in uh, the mermaid doctrine, you know? Mm -hmm. You got, we have faith in all the other type of doctrines that don't really pertain to the what Yahweh Bashim Shah has stated, right? So, you know, but when you have not the spirit that you have by Shimon Shah, you know what you know what it's gonna be. It's gonna be what? It's gonna either be death, it's gonna be a harder time, and you know, and the Lord gonna chastise you if you if he if he find you with sons, man. All right? Go ahead, bro. Um, this is the book of um Saint John chapter fifteen and verse twenty two. If I had not come and spoken unto them, they had not had sin. But now they have no cloak for their sin. Hey, this word done went out, man. Hey, ain't nobody got no excuse. Exactly. All right? Hey, nobody. And that's in the scripture. Mm -hmm. I just brought it out. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So, hey, are you Israelites? That's who we speaking to. You so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Hey, you you done heard this word. So now what you going to do with it? Right. All right? Hey, we, we going to fight to keep pushing this word. Right. So we can get the hell up out of here, man.
Right. Man. That's right. We're tired of this captivity. Damn. It's weary. It's weary on the body and the mind all the yeah, time. Yeah. Kind. You can't do shit. You can't get around nothing. You know? You got to still go in the straight and narrow. People, people try to hurt you. You can't get back at them because you got to let the Lord get them. Yeah. You know, and you want to get them. People, a woman that committed adultery, you can't put her to death. See, see what we did? Right. <laughs> you got to be a hero to understand what this is, man. Lord willing, we got those ears, man. You yeah. know? No? Okay. And so you got to be doing the word and not just, not hearers only, man. That's right. All right. Like the title of the, we didn't even mm -hmm. get that scripture yet. Yeah, right. Go ahead, bro. Uh, this is the book of um, James. Saint, yep, yeah, Saint James chapter one, and I'm gonna start at verse twenty-two. But be ye doers of the word, and not mm -hmm. he hearers only, deceiving your own selves. All right. So, hey, you deceiving yourself. All right. If well, let me get that again, James one and twenty-two. But be ye doers of the word, and not hearers only, deceiving your own selves. So you deceiving yourselves. If you just be in a hearer of the word, all right? Mm -hmm. Listen, verse 23, for if any be a hearer of the word and not a doer, he is like unto a man beholding his natural face in a glass. For he beholdeth himself and goeth his way and straightway forgetteth what manner of man he was. Mm -hmm. uh, you forget what type of person you were because you got, you got lost in the sauce. You got mm -hmm. mixed up in the... In the sense, in the in the worldly in the worldly matters, because you didn't put your whole heart into this thing, you thought that you could have a uh, you thought you can pass you could you could pass the book without nobody knowing, pass it and look around and think you can't fool nobody, man. You can fool, as a matter of fact, you can fool man, but you can't fool right. how about she mouth shot, man. Uh, if you go to James two and fourteen, I got it, bro. So, um. He said, "What does it profit? What does it profit? profit? What does it profit, my brethren? Though a man say he has faith and have not works, you know, works. The word works is an, act, an action word. Mm -hmm. You know, you can have faith and uh, faith and works are action words. But if you do not, you have faith, but you don't do the work. You know, that's why you got." Um, other camps or other guys that just think they could just go on a go on a YouTube page and hide, or they become keyboard warriors. They they fear the eyes of men and not how about Shimi It says, "Can faith uh, can faith save them?" Right. So, can faith save you? It's good to say faith without works is what. Yeah. If faith you have, so you know what Paul say. I show you my faith by my works. You know. That's right. You know. Yeah. So. I think it's down. Let me get it. it. Said if a brother or sister be be naked and destitute of daily food, and one of you say unto them, Depart in peace and be ye filled and warm, notwithstanding ye give them not those uh, things that are needful to the body, what what does it profit? Right. Mm -hmm. You you ain't did shit. You yeah. ain't did nothing to them. They know they got to get some food. Mm -hmm. They know they got to get some clothing to be warm. Your ass tell them to be filled and warm. Yeah, and go about their way. You ain't did shit, though. Mm -hmm. uh, even so, faith, if it have not works, is dead. So you didn't give, it, give them what they needed. Mm -hmm. You just get you just say I got faith that you go. You are the the Lord's if you the spirit to give it. You were right. capable to give it to him. And you right. didn't, you know? And being alone. And so yea, a man say may say, Thou hast faith, and I have works. Show me thy faith without thy works. Show me thy faith without thy works, and I will show thee my faith by my works. So these people mm -hmm. So, so these people that's in your family members that tell you, um, you, you know, I got faith, but you know for a fact they don't, they don't actually practice none of that stuff. You know, they hate people, they hate even themselves. They won't even treat you right. You know, even if they do, to a point, we men of the Lord are out there on the highways and byways and really uh, praying to the Lord in His holy name, man, in the proper name, man, not in the um. Not in just because your family member said Jesus, you didn't even get, you didn't give you didn't get the you didn't get the idea to even try to figure out why well, I want to just call on it 
even though I know it's in Hebrew and I know that's not the right. And some of these people, Christians in the Christian church, know that's not the right name. And they still say Jesus. Yeah. You know? So they know it. So that's what you think the Lord is going to do to them. You know? Knowing that the name is not that. So, you know, so now, you know, the men that have faith in the name of Yahweh Bashim Asha, you know, and, and actually doing doing sufficiently what Yahweh Bashim Asha requires to the best of our ability. Because he already know who is elect. He know who he is, man. So we can't lose with that. You know, we got to be really men of action, you know. All right, you got one more? Oh, all right. You got something? Yes. Uh, the Apocrypha book. Uh, Sirach, uh chapter uh, 43, verses uh, 30. When ye glorify the Lord, um, exclude oh, yeah. him. As much as exalt him, exalt him, yeah. ex exalt him. Mm -hmm. as much as when you come to serve the Lord, it has to be that. Did, did it say that? Sir? Yeah, the Lord. When you come, uh, when you, well, when you glorify the Lord, Lord. exalt him, uh huh, exalt him mm -hmm. as much as he can, mm -hmm. forever, for even, for even, yet mm -hmm. will he, for far. Far exceed, exceed mm -hmm. and when ye exceed, exalt, exalt him, mm -hmm. put forward all your strength, mm -hmm. and be not worried, for ye can never go further enough. Far, 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 far enough. enough. Far enough. Yeah. You can never go far enough. So you can yeah. never go far enough in this thing, man. That's so right. you know, hey, if you, hey, you, you. Exalt the Lord, the Lord will, will, will work with you, man. That's why the scripture said in 320 Revelation, he said, you say, knock a door, he's up, man. He says, Lord, what's up with you, man? Yeah. You, you know? So, you about to get it? Yeah. Okay. He gonna, he gonna get you. He gonna, he gonna put you in his, you know, his wings, man. He gonna hold you, you know? And that's what we, we're here for, you know? Because he, he said, you did, you did the will, you know? He said, the scripture says, because I have kept the word of my patience, you know? I said, I said, keep you in the hour of temptation. So, because you did the work, because you, to the best of your ability through the Spirit, and you, you you may have fell down, but you got back up. You don't let nothing uh, put you out. You know, the Lord got something for you, man. He got what? He got he got the, 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 the kingdom, you know? So, we just keep exalting him. You got it, bro? Yeah, kind of. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 3, and verse 19. As many as I love, I rebuke mm. and chasten. See? Be zealous, mm -hmm. therefore... See, it says, be zealous, therefore, and repent. Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If any man hear my voice and open the door, I will come in to him and will sup with him mm -hmm. and he with me. All right. So you might say, so the Lord, how about you, man? I've seen a little post before. It said, if you take one step to the Lord, he'll take two. <laughs> but it just, there's just meaning the Lord is going to be there. You know, right there, two steps ahead of you. You know, so he already knows what what we need and what we gonna what we what, what we're destined destitute for. That's so right. We have to go through this these uh way with these these wild situations in righteousness for righteousness' sake that we have to we we fight because really we're at a we're at an easy pace at this moment, but soon enough, soon or still, it's gonna get worse. So, you know. So, but all that's going to be counted for you in that day. So, all the way to the end, you know, even if we have to be martyrs, etc. But mm -hmm. the Lord is going to be with you, man. So, you got to keep that name and like tight. Keep the faith in you. How about you, man? Don't waver, man. You know, because what, what this thing is going to, what, what is going to, what's the reward, you know, for giving everything up, you know, and still going out there and losing everything, mm -hmm. you know. In the name of Yahweh Bashim Yahshah, you know, you push it forward. Yahweh Bashim Yahshah is going to come. He's going to save us, man, in that time of need. So that's what he's there for because we, because he told us he will. Lord willing, we those men. So, right. so with that, I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bashim 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 Yahweh Bashim